Hi everyone, it's Star and welcome to my channel. I know I haven't made any videos for almost a month on here. Well, I've made videos, I just never liked any of them when I went back and watched them. And so I just scrapped them. Now here's a few things that I've gotten for the babies. Uh, the only things I've left out is the diaper bag, which I have used it in videos. It's a small black one. And a pair of pants. And they're right next to me, so I'll pull them out. Cute, like, red Asian print pants. These are for Mackenzie. I just haven't got any um, red tops or anything to go with it, but I thought they were cute. And these could be, like, her pajama pants. Her big sister's got a, a vest that's hot pink with the... Um, Asian print, I think there's dragons and things on it, and it's, you know, like a vest, and it'd be good for the winter, so neither one of the girls need to wear them right now. They're into shorts and tank tops and things like that. Anyways, these two little girls I have not given names to yet. This one I'm thinking about calling her Afa, and it means forgiveness or forgiving. Um, I just thought it fit at the time. Her, I don't know if I want to call her Angelique or Amanda. I was even thinking Abby, but I'm I'm not sure. With her, it could go either way. She might be like Satoshi. I've changed that poor boy's name dozens of times. With her, I got her at a thrift store. She had some white like scuffing on the top of her head. I'm bring that up. At the top of her head, and it just... I used my fingernail after getting it wet and just scraped it right off. I probably could give her a better bath. I did wash her down a bit. So she's all clean. The outfit she has on is for a preemie. So it's way too big on her. And the hat, it doesn't match the pajamas. I mean, they both have cupcakes and stuff, but it doesn't really match. But, eh, what the heck. Now with this little girl, I got her at Toys R Us almost two weeks ago. Yeah, it was two weeks ago. It's a little outfit that came with her. And this also came with her. And there was a bottle and like a little birth certificate in her hand. I also got this car seat from Toys R Us. And I even got this box of 20 diapers. I did a video two years ago with some ideas to use for the um, like the 14 inch bear and your babies and it was a five pack of these and they had them at Toys R Us on clearance for $2.99 but for 15 more for $4.99 you better believe I'm going with the box and this is what they look like they're really small um, I think this could probably be used um, maybe baby alive I don't know. I don't have a baby alive. I do have a Zap Creation baby that I gotta finish painting some eyebrows on her. She could wear these. And these little tiny dolls here could wear them. And with this little girl, I love the fact that her mouth is open. So I've taken regular size passies, you know, for um what is it, under six months, and I modified it by just cutting it. And it fits right in. And also with the video I did two years ago, I had got these from a local craft store. And I made them. The only thing is, if you don't seal the lid completely around before you put it on, it will leak. There's no hole, so nothing up here has to be sealed. Now, the fluid inside, yeah, needs to be changed out. But for right now, just to show what it's like for her. And the other little girl, I'm probably going to have to take one of these. Um, how do you say it? The little plastic pieces a regular bottle comes with that's flat. And glue that inside. And that way it could just, you know, go like that when I'm feeding. And give the illusion that she's actually drinking the bottle. But these are all the things I've gotten recently. Uh, if anybody has some suggestions on a real cute name for this little girl, just leave it in 
in the comment section. Um, like I said, I just, I don't know what to name her. <laughs> so everybody, I hope you have a wonderful day, morning, evening, whatever the case may be. So please like, comment, and subscribe. Bye!